friend ordered a fruit salad in China and got one with tomatoes and mayo. <laughs> what? Why? <laughs> that sounds disgusting. What does that even look like? <clears throat> this is the devil in its form. <laughs> this is literally what the devil looks like in food form. It's disgusting. <laughs> Who puts mayo in a fruit salad? Y'all, y'all messed up. Someone needs to send a memo to China that tomatoes, even if they're technically a fruit, I, I still don't know. They don't taste like fruit, okay? They're not sweet. They don't go with bananas. I think this waiter or no, this chef has gone a little bananas. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Anyways, that was a lame joke, but what's up? Today we're looking at food orders that went horribly wrong, like my life. It's gonna be great. So don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Links are all down below. And give this video a like and share. But yeah, comment below your favorite fruit and let's go. I asked for nothing as dessert on a Disney cruise. Got this masterpiece. It's literally nothing spelled out in chocolate with some sprinkles and a little dab of ice cream. I bet the chef, every time he asks his girlfriend what she wants to eat, she's like, I don't know, nothing. And then she wants his food, so he just made this for her. He's like, well, here you go. I think every restaurant should have an option for the girlfriend if she says, I don't know, or I'm fine, I don't want anything, <laughs> then you give her some extra large fries. Cause come on, you know we always want fries. Even if we're full, we want some fries. I ordered a double espresso, so this is what I got. Duh. <laughs> no, I don't want to little mini doll cups of espresso. I want it in one cup, please. That would be kind of cute though. Just two little cups and you're like, doop, doop, energy. You're having a little tea party with yourself. That's sad. So I ordered a lettuce burger thinking it would come on two pieces of lettuce. And I thought wrong. I was very wrong. Ew, that is the worst part of the lettuce. That is, that is literally disgusting. And that is way too much guac, okay? There is a good ratio of guacamole you need on a burger and that is too much. That's like triple. That's the part of the salad <laughs> that pizza places do. Like they just cut a piece of lettuce in half and throw it in a tin foil container and put it on top of the pizza so it was really hot. So when you get it, it's like, what is this garbage? Someone on the Northern Ireland vegan veggie group said they ordered a bean burger and got this. I can't stop laughing. <laughs> Ew, they got canned beans and they put it on the burger. Why? <laughs> on the left, that's what a bean burger is supposed to look like. It's a veggie burger, it's super good. They don't want canned beans, ew. Are those refried beans or pinto beans? I forgot which one that is. Why have I still not put my arms down? How did y'all get it in that shape? Did y'all put it on beef? That's literally what they didn't ask for. Here's some random info. I am actually trying to go vegan. Well, not like totally vegan. I should say plant-based, but first I'm gonna go vegetarian. So I said bye to regular burgers, that was really hard. <laughs> and chicken, that that's gonna be the toughest thing I ever do in my whole life. <laughs> so, wish me luck on my healthy lifestyle. Great, great for me. I never get to eat a cheeseburger ever again. I'm so happy. <laughs> so my friend ordered a fruit salad in a restaurant in Marrakesh. <laughs> what country is that? Well, that's technically a fruit salad. <laughs> they just want you to do the work. That's like when you order food and then you ask for ketchup and they're like, oh, you can do that over there by yourself. It's like, what am I paying you for if I'm doing half the work? This is a, this is a ripoff. <laughs> Ugh, what is that? I ordered a tomato salad with feta cheese and I've got this, <laughs> this creature staring into my soul. <laughs> it looks like a little, a little baby tomato and he's looking at me. He's like, yeah, I'm gonna look at you while you eat me. So you feel bad about it. <laughs> I do feel bad, okay? Leave me alone and let me eat you. Feta cheese, isn't that supposed to be like hard, not creamy? I'm confused. <laughs> Ordered a cheeseburger with only ketchup and I literally got bread with just ketchup on it. They still want the meat, you dummy. This was this person's like first day on the job. They just do the dumbest things. <laughs> they take everything literally. I guess this is technically a veggie burger. <laughs> it's all vegan, there's no meat. <laughs> just got Bella Italia delivered. Did I say that right? <laughs> I ordered a side of chips to come with it. What I actually got was a side of chocolate chips. Wait, what? Oh, they actually got chocolate chips. I mean, that's kind of a win. In my opinion, that's not too bad. It probably doesn't go that well with your salad, but dessert? You're looking at this the wrong way, man. This is a win. She asked for sour cream on the side and they 
just slapped it on the side of the taco. Like here, there you go. She wants it in a little container. That's what on the side means. I mean, if it's there, you can just, you know, scrape it off and slap it on top of the taco. It's Taco Bell, you can't throw that away. Or if you just don't want it anymore, then just scrape it off. Problem solved. Tonight at Culver's, ordered a side of onion rings. What I got? Rings of onion on the side. <laughs> Ew, that's just raw onion. That's like the shavings off the onion. That's not even the good part. Dude, onion rings sounds so good right now. And it's vegan. <laughs> Doesn't mean it's healthy. So I ordered an ice cream sandwich in Thailand. This is what they gave me. Would that taste bad? Just regular white bread with some ice cream? I don't think that would be too bad, honestly. Give it a try before you go, you know, bashing it on Facebook. Cause he hasn't even tried it yet. Went to Wendy's for lunch and asked for extra onion in my chili. They have chili? That sounds good. I guess this counts. <laughs> Yeah, these people are just lazy, honestly. They couldn't take five seconds to just cut up that onion. They just gave you the rings. <laughs> I mean, if you're asking for extra onion, you obviously like onions, so is this a bad thing? Not really. I ordered a chili burger and this is what I got. I need to communicate better. <laughs> they put a whole freaking chili, a supersized Godzilla chili, <laughs> the Hulk's thumb on this burger. <laughs> <laughs> it's the Hulk's thumb. You get it because it's green. Y you get it. <laughs> that gonna be spicy. If you eat that, you ain't gonna have no taste buds. <laughs> this is one of those people that just, they worked in a coal mine for 20 years, so they can't taste anything unless it's lava. <laughs> oh my gosh. Y'all put that bagel in a volcano, man. <laughs> Seriously, Tim, what the heck? <laughs> I ordered an extra toasted bagel and got this for the second time. Well, if it's the second time, then why'd you ask for it extra toasted again? What you want is a regular toasted bagel, I'm guessing. So just get a regular bagel. When you say extra toasted, they're like, what do you mean? You want us to burn it? Okay. This ain't Tim Horton's fault. This is your fault. This is like people who ask for extra mayo and then they get it and they're like, ew, this is too much mayo. That's what you asked for. I ordered ice cream in two cups instead of cones and this is what we got. <laughs> do they realize it was more effort to put it in the cone and then in the cup? You could have just put it in the cup. That's so much less effort. Y'all tried too hard. <laughs> these, these people just don't think, honestly. I mean, I kind of get it. I used to work at Panda Express and sometimes it's so busy and you just, you know, you do things without thinking because <laughs> your brain is just fried. Ordered a tomato salad in Brazil. This is what I got. Thought it'd have a little more substance, <laughs> like lettuce. Well, did they at least put like pepper and salt on it maybe? <laughs> I'm not much for tomatoes. I mean, maybe in my pasta, but just plain tomato, no. That's just ketchup before it got processed. <laughs> I asked the cooks at work for a little bit of mango salsa, and this is what I got, a single, lonely piece of mango. This is so sad. <laughs> These guys were just mad at you. They're like, dude, this is the waiter that everyone hates. Let's just make her mad. <laughs> Cause no one is that stupid. They did this on purpose. That's what I would do. <laughs> My milkshake came out in a box. Huh? How does that even, why? Just why? They probably just ran out of cups, honestly. <laughs> and they're like, how are we gonna get this to her? Guys, brainstorm right now. Box, okay, let's do it, go. Just order takeout and we will make it so complicated for you to eat. <laughs> yeah, cause now she has to like pour it in a cup and it's gonna spill everywhere or she can just, you know, stick the straw in the box but then it's like, you gotta move it around, try to get everything. <laughs> Is it good at least? Probably not. Asked for a side of cheese for my nachos and got this. Why isn't it melted? I've ordered the chips and cheese from Taco Bell. It's pretty good. They always melt it. So these guys were just plain lazy. They're like, guys, I don't, I don't feel like putting this thing in the microwave for five seconds. So just give it to her. Yeah, that is not gonna taste the same. Well, you can stick it in the microwave, but get like a 10 cent discount. <laughs> Taco Bell is so good though. D now I want Taco Bell. Thanks a lot, guys. You're making my whole vegetarian thing very hard. But that is it for food orders that went horribly wrong, like my social life. I already said that. I need a new joke. Anyways, hope you liked it. Again, don't forget to subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Links are all down below. And give this video a like and a share and comment below if you like Taco Bell and your favorite order from there. Mine is probably the cheesy gordita crunch. That's some... That's some good stuff, but I can never have it again. This sucks. I need to rethink my decisions, but that is it. So I will see you weird people next time.